As part of implementing the activities of Component 3 and Component 4 of the project adapting to climate change in Lake Victoria Basin, a four-day session was organized from the 3rd to 6th of August 2021. A regional team conducted by the regional project manager, the national team led by the national project coordinator, provincial and the communal administration agents, and the team from the Burundi Geographical Institute, Ijebu, were present that session. The session organized by the regional project management and the national project coordination has among the goals the design of sub-projects which are going to be implemented in component 4 which is based to community-based adaptation projects. Six sub-projects for each intervention area have been elaborated, presented and validated during that technical working session. The intervention areas are Gitera Nini Muyinga province and Busoni Kirundo province as mentioned by Anisengo Likie, the National Project Coordinator. The purpose of this technical working session it is to design a project for communities uh, in, the inter in the intervention areas, which is Kitera in Muyinga and the Busoni in Kirundo. He asked all the stakeholders to work together for the success of the project as it is the pilot project which will show if it's important and beneficial to the population to be extended or not. It's just to work together, to work as one team and they succeed. According to Busoni Mayor, during that session they gained a lot of things about adapting to climate change as their commune is one of the communes which is affected by climate change in Burundi. We gain a lot of things about uh, climate change and uh, you know that uh, our commune is a commune which is affected mostly by the climate change and uh, in this uh, four session we gained something that will help us to keep our commune in a good climate and I hope that this will be good after applying what we have just studied in this four session. For him, the six sub-project designed will be of a great importance for his population. He calls on all the stakeholders to take that project as their own project for its success. Everyone is called to, be, uh, to take the project as uh, his own uh, the, uh, the, from the administration to the citizens. Everyone has to put uh, his one's uh, thought so that the project is going to succeed. This is what we dream about and we, we see we are going to try to sensibilize and every citizen is going to take the projects carefully and we hope it will succeed. And according to the mayor of Giterani, what they had been doing during the four-day technical working session is leading them straight to the vision of high excellence, the president of the Republic of Burundi, which is about enabling every Burundian citizen to get money in his pocket and what to put under the teeth apart from helping people to adapt themselves to climate change. He ends his statement by ensuring that they are going to raise awareness of every citizen of their commune so that they can know what they are going to do in order to contribute in those sub projects success. As far as the chief of cabinet in Kirundo province is concerned, what they have been working on during that session will help the people of Busan to improve their daily lifestyle and the resilience to the climate change. This is a training which have provided us a knowledge for resilience, climate change, and it is more useful because the people of Busoni, particularly, which are beneficiary, will improve improve the livelihood uh, than it was before. Mobilization and a careful follow-up are what they are going to do for the success of the project, as he added. On the behalf of the cabinet of the governor of Muyinga province, they will welcome the project adapting to climate change, which was brought in their province exactly in Giterani commune. As stated by the provincial advisor in charge of social and development in Muyinga province, during the technical working session, what they were busy doing will help their people to develop their 
themselves and to adapt themselves to climate change. I find that this activity is very important because it will just uh, address some effect of climate change effects and also it will enhance knowledge and uh, capacity for adaptation for the local communities to the climate change effect. To encourage the beneficiaries to take seriously those projects are what they are going to do for the success of the sub-projects and he calls on founders to extend the project in the whole province. Note that in each commune, six sub-projects will be implemented by six cooperatives chosen among other strong cooperatives which are working in those communes. And each sub-project will get a fund of 12,000 US dollars.